Hey guys, it's Albert here, and I thought I'd do something special, something a little different today, but for all of you who live on the East Coast, and I know there are a lot of viewers of mine that live in the Maryland, Virginia, D.C. area, we all know there is going to be a brand new casino, MGM National Harbor, opening up December 8th. I'm really excited, super excited, as I'm sure you guys are. This is a, a little screenshot of the casino, and uh, let me click on this. So this is the website that I'm on, and I thought it would be fun to do a little review of the website just to check and see what's in store for all of us. Um, not just those of us that live locally, but for those of us th that live all over the country, all over the world that may be traveling to the East Coast, uh, to the D.C. area, and may want to uh, take a look at this brand new casino. So it looks like a spaceship, doesn't it? Sort of looks like a, a starship, <laughs> if you're into Star Trek. And it sort of looks like a uh, Aztec temple, but I think this is the garage. I drove by it uh, about a month ago. I believe this is the garage, and uh, and then over here, of course, you got the um, the hotel and the casino on the bottom floor. But it looks very pretty. Um, oh, they have a countdown here: 23 days, 23 hours, 53 minutes. And uh, here's some photos of uh, some of the the suites, the rooms. Uh, but I'm going to get to each of these uh, uh, tabs or most of them just so we could take a look and see uh, what we have coming up. Um, but, you know, we all know that uh, MGM, there's a large collection of uh, hotels, and casinos, uh, all of which are under the M Life Rewards. Um, so I've been to many of these resorts here, um, particularly the Borgata. So Borgata is going to be part of M Life. So I'm really, really super excited about that. And when I was in Vegas a few months ago uh, for G2E, actually that was what, September? I was able to trade up my black card and get converted into a, a gold status uh, MLife Rewards uh, card holder. So that was pretty cool because in the past I really didn't play too much uh, at um, MGM um, uh, in Vegas. So now I could accumulate points here on the East Coast and use them on the West Coast whenever I go to Vegas. But uh, let's take a look at and see uh, the hotel. I'm curious to see how nice these rooms are. I heard from uh, some people um, that have made reservations to stay there. It's, it's quite expensive. Uh, but let's take a look at some of the rooms. They look very nice, very clean, and, uh, uh, so modern. Okay. Let's take a look at some of the room rates too for like a, a let's see for a king suite actually let's take a look at the uh potomac view king i guess that overlooks the potomac river huh um okay 819 but you know what that's for a grand opening week if it's opening up on december december 8th well this, these are two date nights are sold out that weekend is going to be quite happening and um, i can understand why uh it would cost that much but let's see on uh let's take a look and let's pick a uh let's pick something on a week week night let's say tuesday and checking out on the 28th let's see how much that would cost yeah it's still pretty expensive but uh yeah i'm sure the room rates will go down after um grand opening month okay so not too bad uh, let's take a look and see some of the uh, other tabs that we have on their uh, website. So under entertainment, we got Bruno Mars coming in December, uh, Sting in March. I know uh, Cher is going to also be performing at the MGM. That's what I've been hearing on the radio. Boys to Men, Duran Duran, Practical Jokers. Okay, so we got a lot of entertainment coming our way. That's great. Lionel Richie, very cool load more entertainment there we go there's Cher so Cher will be performing at the MGM National Harbor in March of next year so uh, that should be uh, that should be fun maybe they'll have the Cher slot machine there right <laughs> all right so under restaurants I've heard that there is no buffet and I'm really bummed out about that because I love a good buffet uh, in Vegas I love the wind buffet uh, the Caesars Bacchino buffet Bellagio buffet Wicked Spoon at the Cosmo, but there is no buffet here, right? Not, I don't see any listed here. National Market, what is this? Is this like a food court? Take a look and see. Oh, look, look at that, that looks nice. Yes, so you could get your tacos on here. Uh, Vietnamese food, some pizza, so it's like a food court here. Uh, let's take a look at some of the restaurants. Marcus? 
All day dining and drinks featuring classic American dishes with Marcus. I don't know who he is. Fish by Jose Andres. And a steakhouse by these two guys. Uh, I got some dim sum here, it looks like. A ginger. Uh, Bellagio Patisserie. Sorry if I'm pronouncing that incorrectly. <laughs> and a uh, sports bar here. Okay, so you got you got a variety, a lot of variety. And underneath the nightlife section, not a lot going on here, it seems. I expected there to be like a club, um, but you got your bars, uh, cocktail lounge, bars. So that's a little surprising. Okay. Under amenities, if you do plan on staying at this new hotel, let's see, you got pool here, cabana request, spa fitness center, nice. Uh, retail salon uh, let's take a look and see what's under retail I'm curious to see what types of shopping there will be but there is a uh, Tanger outlet uh, sh uh, shopping center uh, not too far from the MGM National Harbor um, and you could actually walk to it I don't know if it's safe to walk but it's so close by if you want to do the outlet shopping all of your shopping desires in one place blah 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 luxury retail shopping so it doesn't look like they've built out the um, the site for the retail portion so um, I'll just skip that then and uh, what we really want to see what I'm more interested in is the casino portion of this website so uh, again MGM is going to be National Harbor is going to be part of uh, M Life um, let's take a look slots that's what we want to see right this is a slot channel so you want to see what the slots are going to be like it says here, bigger means better. Being the largest gaming floor in the area means options. Lots of options. Okay. Well, you know, when I was at Aria um, in Vegas, uh, they did have uh, some slots that I, I did not find at Total Rewards Properties. So I'm guessing the same will, will be the case here uh, at uh, MGM National Harbor. So I'm looking forward to that uh, selection of slot machines. Uh, in the Maryland area, we have uh, Maryland Live Casino in Hanover, Maryland. And we have the Baltimore Horseshoe. Baltimore Horseshoe, of course, is with Total Rewards. Um, and they have their own games. They have some similar games with some different games. But I'm excited to see some, uh, some I'm anticipating a lot of slot variety with uh, MGM coming aboard in the Maryland area. So what else do we have going on in the casino section? Let's see here. Table games. Okay. Poker. Okay. I play poker, so this will be interesting. Let's take a look and see if there's any information in here about the poker room. No, nothing. Okay, so the website hasn't been uh, fully developed, I'm sure, in the coming weeks. Uh, leading up to December 8th grand opening, we're going to get some more uh, details on uh, all aspects of uh, their casino. So, yep, homepage here, room rate starting from two ninety nine. Let's see what else we have going on here. Yeah, it's a pretty casino. Not too far from where I live. It's going to be way too close. About 12, 15 minutes from where I am. Um, okay, so we got some entertainment from Mr. Bruno Mars. M Life Rewards, lots of entertainers coming into the city into the city to perform for us locals, so we're excited about that. And again, it's located in Oxen Hill, Maryland. And um, what else do we have going on? Oh yeah, let me lo log into my M Life. Uh, be right back. Logging into my M Life, and I'm gonna check out my rewards now. I have to. It's a little embarrassing, but I don't have a lot of points with uh, M Life. It looks like I got reset to zero tier credits, so I got some work to do. Um, but I am gold uh, because I got matched up uh, with my uh, black card at the Borgata in Atlantic City, which is now converting over to an MGM property. So uh, let's view my rewards and let's see what I'm eligible for. Isn't that impressive? And let's take a look and see what my M Life exclusive discounts are for our room. Curious here. Well, that's kind of strange because they're not opening up until December 8th. Yet there's room rates here. Okay, so yeah, I mean, December 8th, that's grand opening, $1,500. Then $8,000 for the, uh, the day after. I don't think I'll be doing that. Uh, but then the prices seem to go down, yeah, after a grand opening week. So the following Saturday, three nineteen, um, and then they get, um, well, they, they're pretty much consistent throughout January, $300, $400 range. So the cheapest night, of course, would be uh, the Tuesdays. So let's take a look at February. Okay, 
So hopefully uh, I'll be giving this casino a lot of play, and hopefully I could get some comp nights over at the uh, at the new uh, hotel, and uh, hopefully I could uh, bring you some footage there um, if I am planning on staying there, even though I live about 12, 15 minutes away. So there you go. And uh, if you live in the uh, Maryland, D.C., Virginia area, and we'll be there, and you see me, uh, make sure you say hi. Uh, and I'm sure we're all excited, super excited for this new casino that will be opening up next month. So that's it for now.